Hey everyone. The Cheer Girls and the Molly Gang, including Molly Peterson and I, are going to say that we all are really happy right now, is that because the Cheer Skanks are no more. I'm glad that we all decided to have our moms and dads disown the Cheer Skanks for what they all have done. Not to mention that they all lost the battle and the finally got arrested. I agree. They lost everything for life and now we all got what they deserve. They deserve a lot of karma. I agree with my favorite girls and my lovely wife. After what we all heard about the cheer skanks, they deserve to lose their friends and their boyfriends for the rest of their lives. We all thought that they were going to be the most powerful ones, but we guess not. We all hate the cheer skanks for good and they deserve to have no life forever. The cheer skanks totally earned it, big time. This is what the cheer skanks get for getting involved with murder and they also committed a lot of crimes for what they did in the first place. These bastards are a huge disgrace to the whole society for what they have done. We're glad that we finally decided to cut our ties with the cheer skanks. I 100% agree with everyone, not going to lie. Besides, the cheer girls and the molly gang are a billion times better than the destiny girls and the cheer skanks. Also, the cheer skanks are a bunch of Mary Sue's and pieces of shit with no actual life. I'm so happy and proud that this is all over with, but if the cheer skanks keep it up with our families and friends, they are ready to be executed. I am so glad when the richest girl would say, the cheer skanks deserve to be the poorest girls in the world. Thanks to our moms and dads for disowning the cheer skanks for life. We cheer girls and the molly gang are better off without the cheer skanks forever. What's even better is that we all rock as the new friendship together as the Cheer Molly Girls and the Family Gang. We all are powerful and much better than the Cheer Skanks. Besides, our parents now despise the Cheer Skanks for good, and they also think that they all are a huge disgrace to the whole society and in the whole family, worse than the Randolph Valley troublemakers, since we've also cut ties with them as well. Let's not forget to mention that this rock's so good, and the cheer skanks are history. They also lost their boyfriends and their family, but the Asian girls of them got kicked out of all the magical girl anime fam clubs for good this time. They really despise them, big time. This is the best moment of our lives. My autism and I say that the cheer skanks are finished for life, and they deserve to be put in behind bars for good. My autism also says that they are a big disgrace to the whole society and to their whole families and friends, big time, and my friends and our families and I agree with my autism. Melody Amble and her autism are right. We are so happy that nobody likes the cheer skanks because they are a big disgrace to the whole world and to everyone else in the whole society. I agree with you Sakura. We're much happier improving our behaviors nowadays and beyond because if the cheer skanks and the destiny girls find out about this, their asses are going to be done for by us cheer girls and the molly gang, including our wonderful and lovely cousin Yuna and her sister Ichika. I agree. How can we ever forget about that? I am so happy and proud that the skanks are bye-bye. They deserve to be dead. And let's not to mention that the dreadful terrorism and the trip gang deserve a lot of karma as well, in which we also cut ties with them as well as the Randolph Valley troublemakers. And we all have our rights all together. The cheer skanks' lives are permanently over, they are finished, and they deserve to have no lives altogether. They also deserve to be executioned by beheading. And so, with the cheer skanks' demises, let's celebrate. So what are we all waiting for? Let's celebrate the cheer skanks' demises, big time. Good riddance to these Mary Sues forever.